Good night, good night, good night, everyone. Good night. I hope you all can hear me. Music is playing somewhere. I hope it doesn't disturb the vlog. But I really want to share something. I really want to share something with you all. Um, I've decided to share my life do do YouTube and um, therefore not everything I will post or not everything I will show like some things I will show like this now I'm going to take you on the journey with me because it's something that I I noticed that is not meant to me so I would like to share it now uh you know sometimes in your family you will have like like diabetes diabetes sometimes running people's family and um sometimes high blood pressure sometimes well hypertension not too hypertensive whatever but high blood pressure and some people as i said before have diabetes and um leukemia sometimes you have some people in their family they have eye problem and then something says sometimes parents who get blind or you know so forth now when i was growing up my father died of my father died of um sugar so he was um diabetic right no i don't know if he knew i don't know because as i said earlier on in one of those vlogs i don't know i did not know right what he died from you know as i get older and investigate things i realize that he died of um he was diabetic right didn't take care of himself and eventually died but I know persons with diabetes who live a very long and live good life and so on you know do what they're supposed to do now I am not sure of the symptoms of um, diabetes but I I my bro i have a brother that is diabetic my father was diabetic i have a brother that is diabetic i don't know if my father father was i don't know don't know but i get to understand that you know one and two persons on that side of the family diabetic now with all of that um i am having some experiences that I feel I need to go and get myself checked now I noticed from about about a month ago now my toe them feel on and off like you know I have a tingling feeling and it seems to be getting worse the other thing is my mouth is very dry very dry and me notice it and me now I ignore it no more and um when i walk barefoot i feel something sticking me in my toes um me know some people have a thing for say well then the call long sickness by yourself and not that and not do this yeah call long sickness by yourself and so Nobody now call long sickness on itself. I mean, not may have other things that I notice that I need to get checked out. Now, I'm not a person who I'm honestly afraid of doctor. I'm not like, I'm afraid of doctor. I'm not afraid of doctor. Put up your hand, comment. Are you afraid of the doctor? I am kind of afraid of the doctor. And I wonder if my father was that kind of person. Why he didn't find out, you know, he never go get himself checked and so he died very young <laughs> you know and i don't want to be the kind of person who sit back and have these feelings and ignore them because whether we believe it or not i am now 43 years old 
I am not saying that if I was younger, it would happen to me because you have children that are born that way, right? Diabetic and so on. It could be anything else, but I feel that because um, my father was and I have, my eldest brother is now diabetic, I feel that I don't want to play around. You know, I don't want to play around. I don't want to play around. So tomorrow, I'm going to take you all with me to the doctor. I think I'm going to go to the hospital. I don't know. Comment below what you think. Should I go to the hospital or should I go to a private doctor? Private doctor means that, um, for me, a lot of money. But when I go to the hospital, I get the same treatment. I guess the test, the test is free there. I think, yeah, whatever test is to be done is free there. So why not go and get it done at the hospital? Yeah. People may not want take my may not want to take my health for a joke, you know? May not want to take it for a joke. Oh this feels so this feel like yeah. I don't want to take my health for a joke, right? Because it's not a joke thing. And um based on how I feel from the other day, me feel like say a time now. <laughs> me afraid, me kinda of afraid, but me still have a go. You know? Who know people afraid of doctor? My friend the doctor, me not like me just me just have a fear. Um but I'm going. I'm I'm going. I'm going to get myself checked out. And I'll take you guys with me. Mm -hmm. You know, remember to like, comment, share, subscribe. And if you if you are feeling if you have feelings, do not ignore it. Go and get yourself checked out. Um, hospital is there for a reason. I talk to no people and my mouth dry. I experience this dryness for a very... I don't want to say long, long time, but I notice it now. So, I may told them feel tingly. <laughs> when I step on the floor, people may feel like, like this morning. And during the day, I feel like something has stick me and I told them. You know, so me no want to take none for granted. And nobody nobody say, Oh, me I call them sickness for myself. Nobody no call them sickness for myself. If you're not feel well or if you feel like something is going on that you need to go and check it out, it better you check it out and be on the safe side than not check it out at all and then things get out of control, which are while a good while now me I feel how me I feel and me not doing anything about it. So I don't want to be like the per like my father me not go far for example me not be like my father we never take things up in hand and just just you know just perish away like that just just gone so without a fight like trying like him not even the, to me I one time me see that man got out town the last time in First time in go and the last time. That was it. When me see me never know about no other time. So I'm going to get myself sorted out tomorrow. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what else will happen. Me don't know me just knows that tomorrow. Money or no money, me I go go a doctor. I'm going to go to the hospital tomorrow. I think the hospital is the best place for me to go. So I'm going to go for the hospital tomorrow. It's going probably take a longer time, but hey, your health comes first. So stick and stay with me and come on my journey. I would like to take you all on my journey. As I always said, I don't know who will benefit from this. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know who will benefit from it. So I'm going to share my story with you all. So come on, this this fitting that's all. Oh, they do decor. I look, people. You like my decor? You like what? You you all like this? Comment and let me know if you like my decor. Yes, child. <laughs> me I try a thing, people. Me I try a thing. Me I try a thing with this. Is the um mat? I miss me um spray paint them. We paint it in. This is supposed to be blue, but it, it turned out like a black. Yeah, 
and the 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 um sea fan the fans yeah all over the place yeah people so stick and stay with me i i am smiling because i'm like that i i'm not going to come on here crying away and whatever if there's a situation try and solve the problem yeah try and solve the problem the older you get people take full stock of your life not take it for granted like you're young anymore so take this thing serious all right music up out of road but hope you not affect this if i'm not in tomorrow again may brief or not how what does that mean if this music thing too loud all right stick and stay with me take care of yourself god blessings six o'clock i'm going up by the hospital because um i feel with the complaint that i have well either way private or what, but i feel like i need to go to the to the hospital although mirror them safe <clears throat> for an emergency you know figure but when you're sick when you're not if you're not feel well you're not feel well i mean you have to wait until it becomes an emergency. I feel so. I buckle my shoes, people. I buckle my shoes. I buckle my shoes. So stay tuned. So I'm on my way, people. Bright and early. I'll carry my jacket if anything. Because you know how them say. You know how them. You know when I was growing up, you know how them say. Sam so couldn't pick me up. Oh, so you're going to help people take care of my people, but in Naga come, Naga go, maybe in the two well. Anyways, I know how in time I grew up, you see, um, you have, you have to dress properly go to a hospital or a doctor. Now these, we notice that people are just in a house or something like a doctor. I can't do it in the people, I don't know. Mama, I put something on the table for you here. I can't do it because I never grow so. So, it's not like me dress up. I know I'm sure my outfit. Yeah, it's like a long time outfit I did buy for my birthday on here. <laughs> so, I'm still using it up. A couple years ago, I bought it. Kind of tight and different up now, but. I'm going to throw away my outfit because it is tight. Mm -hmm. So the process is you go, 
you register and sit and wait for them to call your name. Yep. So, my lovely folks, I'm, I'm back. <laughs> me back me come back my love so you know me me carry now on the journey with me and so we're not editing i got to give another the result <laughs> so my love you know say me turn 42 years old and uh, your girl going through menopause Yes, I'm going through menopause. So, the doc said, hey girl, you're just going through menopause. <laughs> Yo, this A, remember me telling you I'm documenting my life, you know. I'm documenting my life, so this is real life situation real life yeah <laughs> doctors say me i go to menopause so me start very soon <coughs> very early mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. so for everybody who feels like this is a joke thing no it's not it's not a joke thing so you all better saggle up on yourself ladies well everybody now must go through the same thing but um may go through it gracefully all the signs and stuff may go through it gracefully all right so thank you all for journeying with me and um <clears throat> yeah it, it it is what it is embrace everything embrace every aspects of your life and so on so back to real back to reality now so tomorrow sunday i am um, i think i have plans for tomorrow i think i might do some work on the house tomorrow might monday no monday is i think monday holiday so i can find myself i want beach monday yeah me oh me make plans and say me go go a beach party monday <laughs> monday me go a beach party we promised the man to me come a beach party so me go go down there hopefully me not feel if me not feel so well or some me, me just stay home but all being well me going to the beach party people it look dark coming out turn on the light it is what it is Let's see if I can turn on the light. But I brought the light and I'll turn on the light. So let's see me and JPS. Look here, me and JPS is no friend. So let me start right here. So yes, so yeah, beach party Monday. And tomorrow. Tomorrow is um Sunday. Tomorrow is Sunday. We might do some work for my house. Me don't know what I want tomorrow. Alright? So thank you for journeying with me. Thank you, thank you, thank you all for journeying with me. Let us embrace our life. We have to pass through. Some people not live to go through this. So yeah. Every experience I appreciate and I go go through it gracefully. You understand? So it's something here, right? Yeah man, but let's go through it gracefully. I go eat some bun and cheese. Bun and cheese. I'm never do. You know, can't. It not make no sense to drink juice with the bun and cheese because it's juice sweet. The bun sweet and the juice sweet. Now I work with that. I drink some water. All right. Thank you all for journeying with me.